Hey everybody, it's Brandon again. Uh, so I was gonna try to make a video for you guys today about installing Chrome OS Flex on my old uh, my old desktop computer. This was a Intel Core i7 3770K. It had 16 gigs of RAM and it had a GeForce GTX uh, 960 video card. And so I thought it'd be a nice uh, test for a Flex desktop so we could go ahead and try some different things out. But alas, I can't get it to boot. Uh, I've had a restart on me during boot twice. Now it's just sitting on the uh, Chrome OS Flex loading screen doing nothing. So I don't think it's going to happen on that machine. <clears throat> but it would have been a nice thing to test. Uh, because usually we do Chrome OS Flex on laptops here. And I thought, uh, hey, maybe it'll work on a uh, not high powered, but certainly high powered several years ago desktop. But no deal on that. So, um,. But anyway, uh, so that that's the fail of today's video. Uh, you might notice I haven't done any videos for about a week and a half here. It, uh, we had visitors for the 4th of July, and then it was my birthday. And then I've just been busy on my real job, Ape Apps, trying to make some money. So that's where I've been. And also, there just hasn't been a whole lot going on in the Chrome OS Flex world. Uh, the dev channel is still on the uh, 104 release that is extremely buggy. Um, I haven't seen any updates to that in the last several weeks now. It's actually, I think, the longest I've seen the dev channel go without an update. So there's really no news on that front. Chrome OS Flex Stable is on version 103, and it works pretty good. So anyone who's wanting to use Chrome OS Flex, I recommend the Stable channel right now. And, uh, yeah, other than that, yeah, there's not much else going on. Uh, I might do some Linux videos over the next week or so here. And also some uh, different Android operating systems. I'll tell you guys what I have requests for. There's a Bliss OS, which uh, appears to be a desktop Android variant. And a Prime OS. I'm not sure what that one is. And um, a review for Deepin Linux. I think that's a uh, Linux distribution from China. I haven't tried it yet, but I think it has quite a few use users, so uh, we might check that one out. And if there's anything else you guys want me to check out, let me know, because, uh, yeah, we usually focus on Chrome OS stuff here, and there's really not a whole lot going on with Chrome OS right now. It's kind of uh, matured to the point where I think it's stable. Anybody who wants to use that kind of system can use it on their laptop, uh, provided it supports your hardware, which is still not great, but... For a lot of the mainstream laptops, it, it works pretty good. So anyway, yeah, not much going on here. Let me know in the comments if there's anything specific you guys want to see. Uh, other than that, I will just uh, post videos as something important comes up. Or uh, or maybe I'll go back to doing stuff related to my software development. Because, yeah, just not a whole lot of Chrome OS stuff happening these days. So that's that. Uh, just want to let you guys know I'm still among the living. I'm doing good. And so if there's anything you want me to see, let me know. Other than that, I hope you're all having a good day. And, um, yeah. Bye now.